We'll start with the guys. Missisquoi Thunderbirds invading to take on the Colchester Lakers. First period, a couple nice chances for the visitors. Braylon Parent leaves it for Mason Lemna. His one-timer is stopped. Later on, Parent tries his luck. Again, Sam Fath there to make the save. Second period. Lakers putting the pressure on now. Watch Andy Rosado nearly dangle his way through the entire defense, but just can't put the puck home. And in the second period, T-Birds finally break the ice. Hunter Mason flips the backhand past the keeper. Missisquoi charges ahead one to nothing. In the third, Lakers on the breakaway looking for the equalizer. What a play from Ryan LaRoche. Pokes the puck away and the Thunderbirds tack on two more scores, cruising to a 3-0 shutout victory. On the girls' side, Burlington Colchester Sea Lakers hosting the Woodstock Wasps. First period less than three minutes in. Mershon Sky does it all herself, dangling through the defense before finding the back of the net. It's 1-0 Sea Lakers. Later in the period, Wasps skating into the Sea Lakers zone. Initial save is made. Kendall Boisvert pokes it through the wickets for the score, and we're tied at one. Midway through the second, Megan LaHoyler slips a slick backhand to the far post. She lights the lamp. Sea Lakers back in front 2-1. But again, the Wasps have a response. Third period pass to Samantha Yates with one flick of the wrist. We're all tied up again at two goals apiece. That score holds for exactly 26 seconds. LaHoyler's shot is stopped. Ruby Wool crashes the net, puts home the rebound. That is your game winner. Sea Lakers skate to a big 6-2 victory. <laughs>